Disagreements and disputes are often accompanied by the emotions, and sometimes it is the very emotions that get in the way of solving the disagreement. Instead, they put the dispute into full swing. Perhaps you find the following situation familiar. All the facts are on a table, You're, the other party should really understand them, but still there's a disagreement and she gets even angrier. So what to do in such cases? So this seminar is dedicated on the emotions. We look at the main accounts of emotions, ask what emotions are, are emotions mere feelings, or do they have some cognitive component as well? Um, do emotions merely interfere with rational discussions and rational argument, or do they serve some usual function after all? In case the emotional dispute cannot be solved by the means of logic, then perhaps some sort of a perspective change is needed. So instead of concentrating on the logic of a dispute, we should focus on the emotions of the participants and try to become aware of them and try to find ways of dealing with them. And of course you might ask how to do that. And in this respect, we look at that, what good advice is on offer from the perspective of psychotherapy. And finally, I would say that don't argue with each other, but if you can't help it, then argue peacefully.